Hey guys, welcome back to Mall Hauls and More. I have a Costco haul for you today, so I hope you enjoy this. I have a lot of stuff, so we're going to hurry up quickly and get into this because I want to get this stuff into the fridge as soon as possible here. So we're going to just start jumping into this Costco haul, so here we go. Um, some things that I've never actually gotten from Costco before, comment down below if you have their clothes section. They have like a like a huge area for that and we were walking past it and like these caught my eye. I was like, oh, I, I want a pair of these. So um, these are the Fila brand and they're like these really pretty like, I don't know what you call this. It's like a periwinkle I think that's what it's called um but they're just like a nice what are these jogger oh they're called purple impression okay they're like a jogger not really like sweatpant kind of looking pant and they have the little logo there I got them in a small because they seem kind of like stretchy so I think they'll work nicely so yeah I picked up one of these um, and they have pockets, which is really cool. So they just look really comfy and I liked the color. So something cute and different from like a lot of black that I wear. So to add some color to my wardrobe is nice. Um, and then I saw these, these were right next to them. These are Puma, Puma shorts. Okay. You get a two pack. I just realized they said youth two pack of youth shorts anyways they look like this I think they will fit I mean I don't see why not I got it in a 10 to 12 I think they're gonna fit I hope because <laughs> I would suck oh my god anyways I got this pink one and then the gray one Hopefully they work, hopefully. And then I got another pair and these are black and pink. And these are cute, I love this little Puma and it's glittery, so pretty. So anyways, yeah, I got these. So I'll have to try it on and see if they fit. Otherwise I can just return it. But um, Puma shorts, I think these were $14.99, something like that. And these were $9.99. All right, so next I have a huge bag of lettuce. This is Earth Mound Farm Organic Romaine Heart. So you get six, six of them. And then I have hauled these as well. So these are the artesian rolls. You get a 12 count in here. My boyfriend picked these up. These go stale really fast. So I don't know. My mom made us some like garlic. She put like garlic on here. And um, he really liked that. So he was like, I want to do that. So I was like, okay, you better eat this then. Like, you better eat these. Get to it, you know? I don't know what it is, but like, he'll buy food and then it just sits there. It goes bad. It doesn't eat. It's like, I have to be the one to be like, force him to eat things because it just goes bad. I'm like, come on, I need you to eat. If you're going to buy this, you got to eat it. You know what I'm saying? I hate when food goes bad. I hate it. So next we did get some everything bagel. Everything bagel, bagels, come on. If you don't like these, come on. Look how good those look. Ooh, the smell, oh, yes. And then these are Parmesan bagel, yes. And then I have this Kirkland, um, just Parmesan. So I picked up one of these. This is always good to have on stock love it um i did pick up this too in my last costco i really like this harvardi cheese this was so good um really really like it i just like eating this honestly on its own you know i mean it's good on sandwiches too but like i'll just take like some of this to work and just eat it so yeah Delicious. Uh, next, I picked up these Made Good Granola Minis. You get 12 chocolate chip pouches. 
and then 12 mixed berry pouches. I don't know if I've had these before. I know my aunt had me try something like this, but like, I don't know. I don't think it was this, but I remember her like, I was eating them and I was like, these are so good. Um, and I found this, so I thought I'd give these a try. And then there were these, these are, Inno Foods Organic Non-GMO Coconut Keto Clusters. So these are just a mixture of pecans, almonds, and pumpkin seeds. So look how good those look. Those look pretty good as well. So just thought we'd give these a try too. Okay, and then I picked up just some cucumbers to get a nice decent amount in there. I have this huge bag of tortilla strips. We got two bags of these. These are really good. And then I couldn't show the salsa, but the salsa, I think I did show in my last video. If you want to go check out that Costco haul, I literally, this is my second Costco video, but um, in that last one, I showed the salsa and it was really good. My boyfriend just took it, so he is eating it, but it's good. I can't even remember what it's called, but it's good. All right, and then I'm so excited to share this chicken again. <laughs> this is what I showed in my last video. This just there, lightly breaded chicken breast. Amazing, amazing in the air fryer. Really crispy. We just got one bag this time, not three like the last time because our freezer is so small again. It's like, I was like, we can't go crazy on the freezer stuff. We don't have room for this. And so we bought one bag and I'm still like, I'm still nervous. Once we get more into this, you'll see more freezer stuff that we have. And I'm like, I'm still really nervous. I hope this fits. He's like, it's gonna fit, it's gonna fit. Like, it better. So shrimp, I love shrimp. We love shrimp in this house. So this is um, like already cooked tail off shrimp. Um, I think it's like medium, medium size. I like the medium size shrimp. And um, I'm really happy that the tail's already off because I mean, it's not like a lot of work to do, but it's just nice when there's no tail. You get 50 to 70 shrimps. So that's pretty good. We love shrimp and rice in this house. So yes. So next, um, my best friend was like, you need to buy this huge bag of vegetables. And I was like, what do you mean? What does it look like? So I love vegetables. Love, love, love. So uh, she showed me this huge thing of vegetables and she's like totally worth it. Get it. You get broccoli, the cauliflower, the hearty baby carrots, and thick sliced sweet yellow carrots. Oh wow, that's what that is. I thought it was squash, but those are yellow carrots. Okay. I'm excited about this. Can't wait to get into this. Another repeat item, um, the ground sirloin and loin of beef patties. You get 18 counts in here. These burgers are really, really good. Um, so these I think were like, I don't know. I don't know how much everything was. I think 18, but I could be wrong. But you get so much, so much and it like lasts, you know? So one thing I really wanted to try was this um, yakitori chicken with Japanese style fried rice. I love fried rice and I thought I'd give this a try. Just one of those like throw in the microwave kind of deals. It says it's ready in three minutes. Contains six nine ounce bags. So I thought maybe this would be something quick. Just eat, I'm hungry, whatever. Um, so I thought I'd give it a try. Not the best for you, but I'm a sucker for things like that. Next is some pepperoni pizza. If you haven't had this pizza before, it's pretty dang good. They do not chip you on the pepperoni, so definitely check it out, give it a try. Um, one thing that we have to buy all the time too, so good to have. Next thing is this Earth Farm Organic Celery Sticks. Not a fan of celery at all, but the boyfriend wants this. I don't know how he eats it. It's just, ugh, I don't know. I mean, I'll eat it with peanut butter. I could do like one and then I'm done. Like I can't just snack on celery. It's just 
not my thing, but there it is. All right, so we did pick up some apples. I was on the hunt. I was like, I really want some apples. I'm trying to eat like an apple a day. And these are the crisp pink apples. They smell so good, so really craving some apples. So I picked up these and then Sean picked up these. Granny Smiths, he likes these. So. so this time around, I was like, I'm definitely gonna pick up a rotisserie chicken. I really want one. And I've been really enjoying like cooking it up like on the stove top, like rotisserie chicken, like, you know, peeling it all off the chicken and then like, you know, putting it in the fridge, letting it, letting it just chillax in there and then taking it out the next day and frying it up and like putting my own seasonings. I've been really liking that. So I picked up a rotisserie chicken. This looks so good. Oh my gosh, it looks so good. Um, I hate like having to like peel all the chicken off of these, but it's worth it, honestly, definitely. And I like to use these for my chicken pot pies as well. All right, so next thing is we got a pack of strawberries. Very good to have. Oh, they smell so good. I can eat this whole thing. All right, so I did grab these. These are something we'd never tried before. I showed Sean, I was like, would you try these with me? They look good. So these are cheddar and beer chicken meatballs. And I hope they're good because there's sure a lot in here, but look how good those look on the packaging. Like cheddar and beer flavor meatballs. And I've cooked meatballs in the air fryer. So good. So I'm gonna definitely give these a try with a meal and um, see how we like these. So yeah, uh, Sean did pick up some uncurred black forest ham. So we got this one and oh, they're the same thing. So we got two. Um, might crack one of these open tonight with some sandwiches. That sounds kind of good. Um, so we got two of those and we did pick up another one of those pepperoni pizzas. So we have two boxes of those. Oh my gosh, I didn't even know he got this. He bought broccoli florets. So we got a bag of that. Another thing that I'm really excited about, I absolutely love carnitas. So I found this like whole container of just slow cook carnita mix so yeah i'm definitely all about this you can like cook it on the stove top or in the microwave so i'm really excited i hope this is really good because <clears throat> if this is delicious i'm definitely going to be buying this a lot so carnitas definitely all day and then we did get this utz pub mix all that goodness in there looks so good all right and then we did pick up some kirkland bacon thick sliced bacon this bacon is so good and oh my god bacon in the air fryer i love my air fryer i'm so happy i got that thing i just make everything in it and everything just tastes so much better um but the one thing i'll say is making burgers in the air fryer, what a mess. You gotta like clean that up right away because if you let it sit, oh my God, it takes forever to like scrape all that off. Anyways, bacon. Yes, bacon. I'm really excited he got this. I didn't really know he got this, but he picked up some Clausen Deli Spears. Yes, so. Well, pickles. All right, and then we got some beef loin, top sirloin, steak boneless cap off. Steak, anybody? Anybody like steak? I don't, but if you do, I'm very good, very good, happy for you. Glad that you like it. I never was a fan of it, just for some reason, I don't know, but these look really pretty. So he got these, he loves his steak men and their steak. Okay, so the last couple items, I'm just going to turn the camera around and show you because I'm not lifting them. No, 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 not. All right, so here are the other two things we got. We got some spindrift. My boyfriend absolutely loves this sparkling water. It's got real squeezed fruit in it. You get 30 of these beautiful lemon, lime, and grapefruit flavors. We did get two boxes of this, so 
they go by really fast with him. And then this is my go by fast right here, Arizona Palmer half and half iced tea lemonade. Love this, good stuff. You get, is that 30, 30 cans? 30 cans, oh my God. All right, so that concludes this huge Costco haul. Did get a lot. I'm praying all this fits in the freezer for goodness sakes. Uh, yeah, so that concludes this video. Thank you so much. I hope you like and subscribe. Um, comment down below if there's anything that you would really like to from Costco. Next video will probably be a Dollar Tree haul or Ross, one of the two, not sure. You'll, you'll find out, but uh, thank you again so much for watching and we'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.